Hi everyone, welcome to Scorpio Squad. Hey Scorpio, how is my Scorpios doing? Hope you guys are all doing great. Big thank you for all your love and support for me and the channel, to your likes, your shares, your comments, your beautiful comments, and, um, and your subscribes, right? Um, for those of you that are new, this is a Strictly Scorpio channel, so if you like my style, if you like what I'm about, then go ahead and subscribe. I'd love to have you here. And make sure to turn on your notification bell to all, so that way you'll be notified when I upload new videos, okay? And when I go live. Um, don't forget to smash that like. It's so important, right, to get the messages out to other Scorpios and make them aware of the channel. And uh, Scorpio, if you are looking for a live tarot card reading from my live tarot card readers, there are toll-free numbers for the USA, UK, Canada, and India. Uh, just mention my name to get your first reading discounted or wait until your birthday to take me up on your birthday gift, which is $10 off your birthday reading. All you got to do is just mention your birthday or your zodiac sign to get that, all right? Um, you can now follow me over on Patreon, Facebook, Instagram. Um, if you're looking for official Scorpio Squad merch, the Teespring store link. And if you want to book a personal reading with me, you can do so only through my website and only pay for it through there, okay? There are imposters out there. So everything that you need is listed down below. Just click on Show More. Telephone numbers, links, social media, Patreon, all that stuff. All right, Scorpio. Let's see what we've got for today in regards to love. For Scorpio, please, dear angels. I call upon my angels. I call upon the white light to come into this reading. For Scorpio. For Scorpio. For Scorpio. Let me just get the initial cards out, right? Well, I see that in the recent past, Scorpio, um, you suffered some kind of disappointment. Uh, feeling like you missed an opportunity here with someone with the five of cups being here okay but I still see you but you were holding on for a victory okay in the present I see you you know moving forward here okay you're right in the center of your read which is also the tower here so we have to see what that's about Okay. I do see, Scorpio, that you will have a victory. In the future, we see an energy where you are trying to get clarity about a situation. And there's a little bit of going back and forth. Now, I don't know if it's between two people. I don't know if it's about relocation. Um love and work I don't know all right here we go okay you may have a choice between two people okay who came out first is this king of pentacles Virgo Taurus or Capricorn I also saw um, you Scorpio Showing up with um, the Queen of Wands energy. Very psychic, very powerful, very handsome, very beautiful. And possibly a resurrection happening here between you and this person. Alright, let me use another deck to clarify. So let's see. In the recent past, why is the Five of Cups here for Scorpio? Why is the Five of Cups here? What happened? Why did you get so disappointed? I love you, Scorpio. Why? Why? I feel you had plans. I feel you had a spiritual connection with somebody. With the sun and the hierophant being here, I feel this situ this whatever the situation that let you down, I feel um, you felt a very strong spiritual connection with somebody. I mean, you saw your happiness with this person. Something happened, and I don't feel it was you. I feel like it was your person who landed up putting their guard up. could have been out of fear so in the recent past why do we have the four of pentacles for Scorpio why do we have the four of pentacles 
Why do we have the Four of Pentacles? The Six of Cups. You're holding on to this person because you know, maybe they're not aware, but you know that this person is your soulmate. And you also understand that the person that you're involved with still needs to heal. Maybe that's why you're so understanding and you're still holding on. Card down, Scorpio. Card down. I'm going to go get it. Ace of Cups. You got a lot of love for this person. Why is the Six of Wands here? Why is the Six of Wands here? Victory, right? In the recent past. Distance between the two of you. I feel at some point this person was actually going to travel towards you. But the hangman is here. And something, again, got stuck. We have the Queen of Pentacles here. Queen and King of Pentacles in this read. So you both are each other's equal here. Okay? You both may have Earth in your chart. Okay? But I feel this person got stuck. Maybe because of what's going on out there, right? In the now, we have the chariot. Why is the chariot here? So, by the way, we have Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Everybody is here. So, tell me why the chariot is here in the now. The two of... Oh, sorry. The ten of swords, the two of cups. So, I feel somebody... Now, it could be you, could be them. Wants to move forward, but doesn't know what the right choice is to do. Okay? And someone's really afraid to get hurt here. Or stabbed in the back one more time. Not from the same person. But in this love. Right? Because Scorpio, I feel you've been hurt before very badly. And you don't, you know, you just don't want to get hurt again. Now, this person did not betray you or anything. Because, see, the, 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 the swords are not going in you here, okay? But you're preventing that from happening, right? It's a very healing energy. I feel like it, it is your wish fulfillment here. So, let's clarify the tower. What is the tower about? What is the tower about? I know it's your card. Why is the tower? Of course, one card this way, one card that way. <laughs> Going Scorpio. <laughs> oh my. The Four of Wands. And. <laughs> oh my. Gang, gang, what are you doing to me? Okay, look. So it's a very special connection here. And I do feel that there is an equal give and take in this connection. So maybe unexpectedly. Things will take a good turn here. The lovers is here. Soulmate energy again. There is love here. So why is the Ace of Swords here in the now? This victory? Clarify the Ace of Swords, please. The Nine of Pentacles, the Magician, and the Nine of Cups. So... I feel here somebody is starting to see clearly here, Scorpio, okay? You may be dealing with an empress here. You may have Virgo or Gemini in your chart, but what I do see here is with the Ace of Swords, communication opening up, wish fulfillment here between you and this person. This person may be manifesting you right now. Or you're manifesting them. So, in the near future, why do we have the hangman? Why is the hangman here? Why is the hangman here? Wow. The king of pentacles. Again, we've got the king of pentacles in here twice. What about the king of pentacles? 
clarify the hangman. Someone is coming in to make this offer. This person is really missing you. I feel that they want to set down this burden. Um, they want to take things slow, but they do see you as their destiny here. Someone's coming in quick. Maybe you. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? Why is the Two of Pentacles here? There's a decision that needs to be made here. Maybe somebody has a choice between two. Scorpio, it could be you. The choice is, do we try again? Do we start a brand new chapter with this Queen of Wands, right? But I feel somebody is overthinking here. So I feel whoever you're dealing with is going back and forth about leaving one situation to come towards you, okay? So someone now is contemplating, should they end the situation with this Queen of Wands? They're doing a lot of overthinking right now. But I'm seeing that this person really does want a new start with you. They want to come together with you and celebrate and have a reconciliation here. Here you are, Scorpio. King of Cups. Alright, so let's go. So someone's trying to figure out, do they put effort into the old relationship or do they just finish that and come towards you? Why is the King of Pentacles here in the outcome, please? Why is the King of Pentacles here in the outcome, please? Why is the King of Pentacles here? Card down. The King of Swords. So this person here may have air in their chart as well or they're acting like an air sign Scorpio you can also come off as an air sign so can Virgo I feel here that this particular individual may know what they want but I feel like they're confused I feel somebody here is dealing with an emperor here and they need more information. I'm also feeling here that this emperor here is suddenly going to travel so you could be showing up as the emperor they are but someone's about to travel and it's unexpected it really is somebody wants to work on things they've made up their mind what they want and they're sneaking away to travel towards you scorpio for this brand new start you, <laughs> they're coming in as the knight of cups towards their empress Scorpio, you're going to be asked to leave behind what happened in the past so that you can build and have a future with the person, okay? And stop looking at what happened in the past between the two of you, okay? And look ahead and see with clarity, right? Justice will be restored in this situation here. Somebody's clearly making you an offer here. All right, and they are being truthful, but you're really stressing out about it, okay? We do have victory here with the moon, okay? So things are hidden, but you're going to have to use your intuition, okay? When it comes to this person offering stability, marriage, right? I think it's meant to be here. Judgment just came out. And now we've got the Queen of Swords as well, which I feel that's your energy. Okay? You're going to have to let go of past heartache in order for this to work. Okay? This person is going to apologize for hurting you. They want to offer you stability here. Okay? Don't argue. You're going to have to heal something first between you and this person. Alright? So that you can move ahead. 
all right but the opportunity is there if you want it all right but I feel this person is not coming back um, the same as they were before Scorpio they're coming towards you differently all right so that's what I have for you I hope you enjoyed this don't forget to like subscribe and hit your notification bell and follow me over on patreon I'll see you later love and kisses